this is Cycling Explorer. I want to talk to you today about hydration, how to make sure you get plenty of fluids. Normally I take one, two of these with me on my bike, they're each 20 ounces, but on a hot day like this, I think it's 89 degrees right now here in Columbus, I need something more. So what do I got to do? I actually reach for my hydration pack. Now, I don't know if you've ever gotten one of these or looked at these at Dick's or a place like that, but these are absolutely excellent. Now the one I happen to have happens to hold two liters of liquid or a little bit over half a gallon, which is excellent for a long ride, maybe a walk in the park, uh, a, a small hike in the woods, or even going to the zoo. These are absolutely excellent. So how do they work? Well, each one comes with this tube. At the end of the tube, you squeeze it with your teeth and lets the water out. So that way it's not dripping down your shoe while you're riding or whatever else you happen to be doing. So this is kind of a cool idea. Now one of the nice things and features about this is not only does it have room for your keys and things like that, it also has a hidden little pocket in the bottom, which I absolutely love. This actually comes out and basically you can put your helmet in here, specifically designed for a helmet. So when you go for that walk in the woods, you actually have something to hold your helmet with so you're not carrying it with you anymore. This is an excellent idea. So you ride a few times, you take this out, what do you actually do to clean it? Well, what I found the best way to deal with that is to fill it up with water and typically two tablespoons of either bleach or baking soda, shake it up and let it sit for a few hours. That'll get rid of any of the bacteria or mold or anything else that happens to be growing in this. So you have a way of cleaning it because you need to do that too and make sure after you empty it all out, you rinse it out really well because you can have a little bit of that residue in there too. This is Cycling Explorer giving you my tip of the day. Thanks for watching. Now don't forget to subscribe.